What is up YouTube, Skiz1 here. As you can see today, I've got a few graffiti supplies to be unboxing here. Now I know the package looks small, don't be deceived. Quite a few different things in here actually. I'm gonna get right into it as I tell you a little bit about what uh, I got here. Basically, I just wanted to restock on a few things and just try a couple things out. So, of course you get your standard load of paper. Now the first thing I'm gonna pull out here is a pack of a lot of different kinds of caps. I'm gonna go through some of them here just to show you guys. Basically, I got a bunch of different caps. I've always had just a few caps that I use and they're the ones I use for all my pieces. But I figured, you know what? While I'm stuck at home here most of the time, might be a good time to, you know, try a few different new caps out. I'm trying some out like these needle caps, these guys here, I'm trying out the new cream cap and basically what my aim was was going to be to try these out but i also wanted to have you guys there to try them out as well so what i'm going to do is do maybe a comparison video between some different kinds of caps if the video is up you'll see it in a card now but hey if the videos aren't up yet maybe you can consider subscribing to see those videos later on i also got some you know lego fat some of these ones that are sort of less common and you don't see very often this is the new flame skinny cap like you know just some ones i wanted to try out this thing i was a little hesitant to buy it it's 11 bucks in canadian dollars that still works out to like eight us or some ridiculous number for one cap it's the mosquito cap definitely gonna be putting my thoughts out there for all you guys on this one because you know the price is pretty steep so i got some interesting markers here for you i went ahead got myself some nice pilot markers this god motherfucker stop cutting their grass jesus so as i was saying i stocked up on some pilot markers here i actually believe it or not have never used these broad pilot markers i've used their fine liners and whatnot but they're owned by a japanese company a lot of the japanese companies make really really good uh writing utensils in general and of course that has translated well to the graffiti community if you haven't seen one of these before very sort of a, a cuttyish uh thing to write with got the red color of that and i also got the other two colors they offer which are the black and the blue we'll have a review of that at some point if it's up again it'll be in a card i went ahead and wanted to try out the mark all bees that are the metallic colors never tried them out before mainly because you know they're like four bucks instead of a dollar fifty or whatever the price difference is but i figured i'd go ahead and actually give these a try see if they're any different at all so we got i believe their aluminum color as well as their gold and their silver you can barely tell the difference at all between the aluminum and the silver the silver is just maybe that much more sparkly but we'll see how that translates into writing and another thing that i've never really bothered buying is uh, one of these markal b1s basically it's just a king size markal here's what one looks like compared to the regular markal size markal does actually make a thinner one than this regular size but they're sort of hard to come by unless you're gonna buy them directly from the manufacturer well i had to bounce from outside because people just insist on cutting their grass but you know just give you guys one last look at uh, the little bit of stuff i got here as much as it's always nice as a graph writer to just stick to the stuff you're used to painting with like honestly most of the time i'm fine with like a vegan outliner cab and a new york fat and i could probably do almost all my pieces with just those two caps it is nice to try some stuff out every now and then step out of your comfort zone that's really what's going to help you improve sometimes stepping out of your comfort zone trying some new things trying some new techniques and hey, you might find some cool new writing tools that you love to use. We got lots more to come on the channel. If you're new to the channel, we do a lot of graffiti reviews here, a lot of freight train watching. I showcase a lot of my work on the channel as well, and we really are a graffiti community. Feel free to hit that subscribe button if you like what you see. You can check some more of my stuff out here if you want to get a better feel for the channel. Lots more to come. Till my next video, peace.